Okay, so I'm really tired of you guys asking. I'm just going to show you how to install the mods here. You have all different kinds of mods. Now, listen, you got to know some are going to be outdated. They get outdated. They get updated. If you put outdated mods in your game, you're going to crash. So if you get crash messages, then it's likely that one of your mods is bad and you're going to have to figure out which one that is. So to get started you're going to go to the mods channel in the fmp server and let's say for instance this emote wheel here you want that so you're going to click download and then you're going to click download and then you're going to click download and you're going to install the virus just kidding all right so you're going to put it in i put it in my hacks folder okay i have my special designated hacks folder it's got a folder exception for the antivirus and all that anyway that's not important it is important but anyway so you're going to put it here and you're going to download it in there where your special safe place is that is not going to get detected and then after you get it you're going to go to your special safe place that is not detected which is my hacks folder over here okay and then let's say emote wheel okay that I got, I'm going to unzip it and I'm going to take it out. All right. So after I take it out, let's say, um, for instance, I've got a, let's say I just drag the files here. This is going to give me three files. Normally you're going to have four. The emote wheel is three, but anyway, this says win GDK. That means it is for the windows. Uh, and I'm sorry, it's for, it's for Microsoft. Microsoft Store, Xbox app, that's these files are going to work in that. Now, if you wanted it for Epic Games, you're going to have to highlight, right click, go to show more options, da, 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 rename, and then you're going to click here. I highlighted them all, but I'm going to change the first one for EGS Epic Games Store. I think that's correct. Okay. And then I'm going to hit enter and it's going to change them all to EGS. Now you shouldn't be on Epic games anyway, when you're cheesing, because, well, you're just going to have to keep buying new accounts. The best way to cheese is going to be at the moment on Microsoft store. Cause you can do family share unlimited accounts, as long as you're clearing credentials and all that jazz. So anyway, if it's going to be for uh, Steam, which you shouldn't do, once again, Steam is limited on family share, but if you are on Steam, show more options, rename, and I think you're just going to put this at Windows, I believe. Pretty sure that's right. I could be wrong about this. I hope I'm not wrong about this, but um, so let's say back to the FMP. Let's say, for instance, um, Okay, let's say this Nia skin, right? FMP Nia. So we're going to come here. See, they say Windows. That's going to be for Steam. Okay, so you there's four of them. There's usually four. You got to rename all four. Okay, once you do all that and you rename, then what you're going to do is you're going to take those files. Let's say we wanted Renato Peacemaker. We come over here, we visit the site we click download and then let's just say i'm going to download it right here in my hack folder i'm going to go over here and then i'm i'm going to have to extract them and pull them into i got so many folders open now i don't even know all right let me just get rid of those stay organized by the way i'm just i'm being all messy just to show you but let's say I want all those. I put them in here. I'm going to highlight them. I'm going to do, go to more options, rename. Now I'm going to put in win GDK caps. And then I hit, I click off and they're all renames. Okay. So now that you got them named, you're going to take these and I prefer to copy them. Uh, rather than drag them. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to open my packs folder in Dead by Daylight. Now that is going to depend on where you have the game installed. For me, it's right here. This PC, local C, Xbox games, Dead by Daylight, content, Dead by Daylight, content, packs. And then I'm going to click in here and control V to paste it. I already have it in, so it's just going to replace the ones I already have for that but they're coming in down here and so 
that's how you put in the packs, right? Now, like I said, beware of old mods, broken mods, um, outdated mods. If you do have crashes, what you want to do is go down to, I believe it's pack chunk four or five. Let's see. It's like five, nine, nine, nine. I believe it's that one, right? Anything under that is going to be mods. So you can delete all those and start fresh and try again and only put good mods in there if you're getting crashes. All right, so that should cover it. I believe that explains everything. Now there is this mod manager tool that the elite have, right? And you can, I mean, good luck if you can find that, but you know, that's super cool. And in which case I can just like, look at that, he's awesome. All right, so I go installed mods and it actually shows me all the mods that I have installed and I can uninstall any particular mod. Let's say I realize, okay, this mod is bad. I want to get rid of it or whatever. I want to, want to change it with something else because it's over the same character. And then you can go into mods. You can click install mods. And then these are all the ones that are in your folder. Anyway, I'm not going to go into how to use this, but I'm just letting you know it is there and it's available if you can talk to the right people. But anyway, just do it the manual way for now. If you don't, if, if you're not one of the special chosen elect to have access to the magical tools, but that's going to be it for the moment. I don't want this to go on for too long. Wow. It's been too long already. All right. See you later. Subscribe, like, comment, share, subscribe, put something that put a thumbs up because you know, the ratio from likes to dislikes that the haters are always the loudest. So make sure you put a thumbs up and uh, make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel, trollingprofit.com, join the discord and all that stuff, you know, do all that stuff that you're supposed to do. Like put a comment, share it, like it. And, uh, I love you guys and take care. God bless.